Welcome. So what I'm going to do is show you how to graph a line, or actually just uh, write a line that's going to be perpendicular to y equals 4 thirds x plus 6, that is going to go through the point negative 4, negative 1. So when talking about perpendicular lines, is the main important thing we need to look at is remember, perpendicular lines are going to intersect at a 90 degree angle. Um, they can, but don't always have to have the same y-intercept. But more importantly, that we need to understand what is it about their slopes. So the first thing, remember, we know that sometimes they might have the same y-intercept or not. But the main important thing about the slopes, parallel lines had exactly the same slope. But perpendicular lines, remember, if one was positive, the other one had to be negative. So in this case, I need to find a line that's perpendicular to this. Well, this slope is positive, so therefore my new slope has to be negative. And also, the slopes are reciprocals of each other. So I'm going to have a negative 3 fourths x plus b. Now, I do not know what my new y-intercept is. It could be 6, but it also could be something different. The only thing I know is that my new equation that is perpendicular to my line goes through the point negative 4, negative 1. And that point is a solution to my new graph. So therefore, I have a coordinate of x and y for that point on the line. So what I can do with those two points is I can plug these two points into this equation. Since I know, since it says it lies on this line, I can plug these two points into this equation to, um, and it will make it true only for the value of b that will make it true, or only for the correct value of b. So I need to find the correct value of b that when I plug in my points x and y into this equation, my equation will be true. So let's go and plug in my y, which will be negative 1, equals a negative 3 fourths times a negative 4 plus b. So now what I'm simply going to do is the negative 1, it's just negative 1, equals a negative 3 fourths times negative 4. That's over 1. So those are going um, to divide out to 1. Negatives turn to positives. So that becomes a positive 3 plus b. Then I solve for b by subtracting, and I get a negative 4 equals b. So therefore, the y-intercept of my new equation is not the same as 6. It's actually um, equal to negative 4. Now I know, remember, I have my new slope is y equals negative 3 fourths. So I'm going to use that. So I have y equals a negative 3 fourths x, then minus 4. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you find or uh, write an equation that is perpendicular to your line and that goes through a point. Thanks.